I just walked through the guest room down the hallway to the living room past our gecko friend. Give you your bearings. Love how bright this house is. So we're going to continue on. This is the kitchen to the right and um, living area, but I'm going to come back and show you that. Formal dining room. Another entrance towards the kitchen, living room area. Stairs lead up in rough sun timber ceiling, lead up to <clears throat> guest room two and its bath. And here we have the pool, which is an interesting thing in Santa Fe. I'm not sure it adds a lot of value to your property. Beautiful ceilings. Again, wood burning. Master bath. I'm surprised I haven't seen this house as long as it's been on the market. Um, master shower. And your closet. Not a real big closet. Not sure my wife would approve. That would end up being mine, probably. And this would be hers. Nice skylight, real bright. <clears throat> Old courtyard off of this. Master. Out into the little backyard. It's nice. The whole thing's walled off, and then you have coyote fencing there. It's well built with oil pipe. And then that's that gate just past the cars where we started out. Real pretty. I love the territorial style. <clears throat> just off of the master is yet another shower. Works through the courtyard. It's really pretty cool. Vanity. Much lower ceiling here, but it's, it's nice. And this is your cabana bathroom because now we're at the pool. That's to the master. That's to the hallway. That's a mechanical room right there. Out to the backyard. Pool's got a couple cracks in it, um, which definitely would need to be addressed. So I have a pool and a similar slant fan heater, um, but that's your heater for the pool. Filter system. Great light. That's the living room. Little entertainment area. Outdoor cooking. And then this is the patio off the living room through that door right over there is just outside the garage in that beautiful circular driveway. This would be interesting to use just because there's no vent ventilation. I'm not sure how that works. Have to explore that. Nice built-ins here. Ample storage everywhere. Little shelf pantry. So now we're in the kitchen. And a little living room with a bonco surrounding the fireplace. It's not a super roomy kitchen. Um, so depending on how much you want to cook, it's nice you have gas. Um, it just really depends. So then just off the kitchen, got the laundry and a little powder room right off here. It's an interesting placement. I kind of like it. And then a multi-purpose Studio room with a sink. Neat room. And then this leads to 
That's your mechanical room, so that's your boiler right there. And those are your, excuse me, five zones. I told you six, I think. So you have, those are all your zone valves. But the fact that it's copper piping is fantastic. No concerns, you know, 85 to 89 when they built this, Entran was an issue. So <clears throat> that's great. We can see the raw adobe here. This is the garage. And again, super bright. It's nice. All right. I'm gonna head upstairs and show you the final guest room. <clears throat> Here's your stairway. Nice thick adobe walls. This is facing to the northeast. So <clears throat> that is Santa Fe Baldy out in that background there. Downtown would be that direction. Wood burning fireplace. They have this set up as an office right now, obviously. Again, rough sun timbers. Your closet space is here. Not super deep, but adequate. Then we come over here. That's looking down towards the hallway, obviously. Another closet. And bath. A little evidence of some leaking going on. But again, they've disclosed that there are some roof issues. The roof is a torched down bry, um, modified bitumen. It's actually a very good roofing system. Um, it just needs some maintenance um, for sure. You can see where the pooling occurs there. It just needs a little bit of re-sloping, etc. So you can see there's no flue on the chimney or uh, built into that fireplace. So that's very common with old, old houses here. Not so much those built in the 80s, but um, you know, in the winter when you'd be using the fireplace, they cover it up. <laughs> um, this one clearly has a flu. Okay guys, that's it.